Okay, so we have cats and dogs as kinds. What are some other examples? Oh, there's lots. There's the, the sea lions that we looked at this morning. We've got grizzly and polar bear. They're members of the bear kind. Duck swans and geese, are members of the duck kind. And now the dogs are really interesting. So in Russia, they did this experiment where they tried to breed foxes to be more tame, right? And they ended up with these foxes that looked like little dogs. The oh. ears started to droop and they started to bark, which is really weird. And so just by breeding for a single trait, you can end up making all sorts of other weird changes in the, the appearance of these dogs, which I think is another great example of how, you know, the traits that we think of as defining a species are really, they're all embedded into different members of a single created kind. So those foxes actually were still carrying that dog kind within yeah. them, weren't oh, they? Oh yeah, that's, that's the amazing thing.